Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to class. Mark Price here at devslopes.com. And boy, do we have an exciting show for you today. You're gonna learn how to set up GitHub and that's it. So let's go ahead and get started. What you're gonna wanna do is open up your favorite browser and go to github.com. Okay, and what I want you to do I'm not going to do this for you because I'm sure you filled out a form before. Okay. Sign up for GitHub. Okay. Verify your email, all the things that you need to do, as you can see right here. So, what I want you to do is sign up for GitHub. And once you're there and that's all done, okay, pause the video now and do this. Assuming that you've just done that and pause the video. What I want you to do is go onto your favorite browser again and type in GitHub SSH Mac in Google, okay? And you're gonna see right here at the top result, generating an SSH key. Okay, you see this right here? This is the article that you want to go off of. I'm not gonna go through all these steps with you and actually do it here on the screen because they give a step-by-step -step guide and it is so important that you start learning how to read documentation in order to achieve things. Plus, I already have an SSH key, so uh, I don't wanna overwrite that as well. So what you wanna do is go to this website here. They have a version for Mac and for Windows. Okay, if you have already have an existing SSH key, then you already know how to do this process. I'm assuming that you don't. So what you want to do is click on generating a new SSH key. Okay, and here's the steps. You're going to open up your terminal. Okay, like so. And you're, all you're going to do is follow the steps. So right here, let's make this a little smaller. Okay. Right here, what you would do is you would just, you know, type in SSH key gen, all those same things right there. Okay as you can see right here, except your email right here will be your GitHub email, okay? And you're doing this on your computer because what we're gonna do is generate an SSH key. And if you don't know what an SSH key, I probably should have told you that. Let's go back one here. Uh, SSH keys are a way to identify trusted computers without involving passwords. You can generate an SSH key and add the public key to your GitHub account by following the procedures outlined in this section. So SSH key, is a secure key that allows your specific computer, your very specific computer, to access remote servers. In this case, GitHub, its own server, so you can um, push and pull data back and forth from it, okay? Again, so you use those keys instead of having to type in a username and password every time. So it's secure, and you'll use this as you become a more experienced developer, as you have to log into servers, you'll, you'll use SSH to log into servers, and uh, anyway. So it's tied to your very specific computer. So if you're working on more than one computer, you will have to do this process for each computer. Okay, so you're gonna do this here with your GitHub email. Okay, and then just follow the steps here. It's gonna ask you to enter a passphrase. If you don't want one, you don't have to enter one. And then it says in terminal, copy the alpha alpha numeric key fingerprint UC. And uh, it continues to give you the instructions here. I just want you to follow these. I wouldn't even have made a video on this, but I just wanted to point you in the right direction here, okay? And once you've done all these steps, you can go back. The next thing you're going to want to do is add a new SSH key to the SSH agent. This again is from your terminal. All you need to do is type this in here. You don't need the dollar sign, okay? And then after you do that, you just have to do that. You can copy and paste this right into your terminal, okay? That's all you got to do. And go back. Lastly, adding a new SSH key to your GitHub account, okay? All you have to do is copy this right here paste it in your terminal, and it's gonna print out your key. Okay, it's gonna print out your key right to the terminal, all right? And then what you're gonna do is, in fact, we'll just do it right here, okay? So it's now copied that key to my clipboard on my, on my computer. Now what I want you to do is go back to your GitHub account, okay? Click your little image at the top right, and I want you to go to settings. And what you're gonna do is click SSH keys. Okay, I've got a few keys here for different computers. You're gonna click add new SSH key. Give it the name of your computer, you know, my cool MacBook. And then right here in the box, since you've already copied it, remember we did the PB copy over here, it's on your clipboard, just command V to paste. Paste everything, okay? Paste everything that, just paste it, all right? that just came on your clipboard. I do like to press the back key one time just so it doesn't add that new line character there, but just paste everything that was on your clipboard and click add SSH key. 
and you will now be able to talk to GitHub so your projects so you can push and pull on your projects and in the next exciting episode we'll talk about how to actually do that okay so that's it getting your SSH keys ready to go and putting them on GitHub Mark Price here at devslopes.com let's move forward and remember to get your free live help go to devslopes.com and click on the chat room we have thousands of students in there helping each other out also click on the forums this is where you can search for answers to your code problems and you can also post your own issues so head on over now